Hey what's going on guys, Turkey Bertie here and welcome back to another Minecraft morning show for version 1.15. In this story we are going to be going over how you can create slabs. Um, so a lot of people have been getting confused on slabs, um, but they're really easy, so I'm just going to be covering them um, in this video. Um, so let's get started. So first thing we're going to want to do is go in our block in it and do a public static final registry object of block and we'll just call this um, jazz underscore slab and that's going to equal blocks dot register uh, versus the name so jazz underscore slab and then the supplier it's just a normal supplier but it's a new slab block and this just takes in the properties now what we can do here is just block dot properties dot from and we can just get it from block in it dot uh, jazz planks dot get just like that and we can just format that and that is actually it for the code. Um, now all we need to go ahead and do is go and do the JSONs. So you can just go and source main resources, uh, assets tutorial mod, block states, and we can just go and get the slab. So if we just go into our reference libraries, which it might not be called that depending on your IDE, uh, but you can look up what that's called. Uh, assets, Minecraft, block states, we can go ahead and grab the uh, acacia slab, uh, not the stairs slab, and we can just copy this, and then we can go ahead and go into our block states package, new untitled text file, copy that in, and we can replace block slash acacia with tutorial mod on block slash jazz and just replace all give that a save in source main resources assets tutorial mod block states and this is just jazz underscore slab dot json there we go and now we just need those three block models so we can go into the models uh, block and we can just copy the free acacia slab so uh, actually there's just two isn't there slab top and slab uh, wait what was what's the other one it was looking oh yeah planks jazz underscore planks so that just uses the planks for the double one because it's easier than making a new block model so now we can just go in our models block uh, I'm just going to copy an already existing JSON just to save the time of saving it. And once it loads, which it will take a second or two to do, uh, hopefully it doesn't crash. It's already not responding. Yep, yeah, there you go. We can just call this one jazz underscore slab. So that will be the bottom one. And then another one which will be jazz underscore slab underscore top which will be the top one and we can just open these and we can copy acacia slab into jazz slab and acacia slab top to jazz slab top and close those minecraft ones and we're just going to do the find replace again um, which is going to be the exact same thing but instead of block it's going to be blocks uh, as we have it in our texture slash blocks, not texture slash block. Save those and close those. Uh, next is the item model. So uh, we can just copy an already existing one again. Jazz underscore slab. And I believe this is just a normal item model. So it will just parent off of the normal one yep it does so you can just go into jazz underscore slab 
tutorial mod blocks and that's just going to be not blocks just block jazz underscore slab there we go um, next we can do the lang it's pretty simple just come down here and do a new one and block dot tutorial mod dot jazz underscore slab and we can just call it a jazz slab there we go um, and finally actually that is it that's it isn't it yeah um, oh actually we do want to do some block drops uh, a loot table which I haven't been doing for a lot of my blocks um, I do apologize uh, I will update my GitHub with those block drops at some point. Um, but we can just make a new loot table because obviously slabs are slightly different because we have double and non double. So we can just have here jazz underscore slab. Open that up. And I'm just going to copy this one, which I have got from the Minecraft code. Um, just like that. Um, and we basically just want to change these to our slab so tutorial mod jazz underscore slab there you go uh, no that's what I want to change it to whoopsie uh, bruh why do you not want to listen to me bruh hello clips there we go I don't know what was happening there and just format that save it um, as you can see what it basically does is it checks if it's a double using the property right here uh, if it's a double it drops uh, a count of two and else it just drops a count of one um, so it's pretty simple um, and then you actually just want to add it to the tag as well so in blocks we can create a new well not there actually in our minecraft data we can create a new uh, untitled text file and in here we can just do replace is uh, false because we don't we don't want to replace and then the values just like that uh, that's the wrong one there you go and in here we can just do uh, tutorial mod colon jazz underscore slab and just give that a save so source main resources data minecraft tags blocks and jazz and uh, no no just slabs isn't it slabs dot json there we go and that will be our slab added to the JSON, uh, to the tag, I mean. And now we should just be able to run the game. So I'm going to run the game, and I will see you guys there. Okay, so guys, we are now in the game. Uh, as you can see, I have my slab right here. I found it in my creative inventory. Now if we just place it down, obviously it's a slab. Uh, and we can make it a double by placing on top, and then obviously on top, and on top, whatever. Uh, you can place it like that. Uh, underneath um, and obviously you can place you know on the bottom uh, you can place underneath the top one whatever um, I don't really think there's any other combinations you can have uh, that a slab will allow um, so yeah I mean that's pretty much it uh, well that is it for this tutorial um, so if you guys did enjoy this tutorial please do be sure to smash your face into that like button and subscribe uh, if you really enjoyed please do be sure to share it and uh, yeah I will see you guys in the next video goodbye